ich habe mich deshalb noch mal versucht, ein bisschen zurückzuversetzen in das Jahr 2005, als ich Bundeskanzlerin wurde. Und die Welt hat sich in dieser Zeit, das darf man sagen, doch sehr wesentlich geändert. Chinas Volkswirtschaft war damals noch kleiner als die Deutschlands. Heute ist sie fast viermal größer. This is Hyperion with Key. Extraordinary 2020. China's economy proved itself with an extraordinary transcript. January 18th, NBC of China released brief statistics showing that China's GDP has exceeded 100 trillion yuan in 2020, a year-on-year -year increase of 2.3%. Less than an hour after Beijing released the data, New York Times breaking news reported that as most major economies are shrinking, just one major economy has bounced back after bringing the coronavirus mostly under control, China. China's strength seemed improbable. After a 6.8% drop in GDP in the first quarter, China became the first country bringing COVID under control, first economy reopening, and the first one shifting economic growth from negative to positive. Its GDP growth curve therefore shows a beautiful V-shape. This is indeed a victory against the art. Recovering economy has brought sunshine in the summer to the global economy. Bloomberg Economics said China's pattern of its growth matters for the global economy. China continues to strive to move towards great reliance on consumption for growth. For the rest of the world, China will increasingly become a consumer in addition to the producer role it has long played. Global growth today remains more dependent on China than ever before, reported by RFI. Luke Bars even calls the current period a Chinese phenomenon, offering investors an opportunity that does not present itself twice in a generation. And going back to our favorite kind of leading indicator of, of M1 growth in China and including household, household deposits as well, that tells us quite clearly that, um, that Chinese GDP growth should be accelerating through this year. Um, we do think that the export numbers and normal Chinese numbers for the first quarter will look extremely strong uh, and then also in the second quarter will look extremely strong. 2021 world has reason to believe China to bring more surprise to a global recovery. This is Kim. We'll see you later.